Hey everyone, this is Jahan, the Forever Optimist, your gangster guru. Today we're at uh, Runyon Canyon in uh, Hollywood. So you can see the, the hills, there's the Hollywood sign, right about right there. And um, Ella Yoga is down around there, downtown right behind me. Uh, people hiking and enjoying the day. It's a beautiful uh, winter day in in California, but I do want to send first and foremost love to all those people that are battling with fires. We've had some close friends that have had to be evacuated, people that are really close to it. So a bunch of love and light to those people out there. If you can do an Indian dance, do your Indian dance. But today we're specifically talking about battling obesity and uh, the difficult, the difficult uphill battles that you'll struggle with with obesity. And uh, most importantly, number one, is to understand that obesity is absolutely normal. With the amount of food out there, with the amount of processing, with the amount of drugs in the food, the chemicals, the stimulants in the food, it's okay to be where you're at. It's okay to say, hey, you know what? I'm overweight, I'm battling obesity, this is hard. Uh, and ask yourself, do I need to come to terms with a an eating disorder? Uh, whether it's overeating and undereating. I've, I've typically had both. I can overeat and I can undereat. Uh, I've never been the one to, to vomit and, <laughs> and force myself to, to throw up, but it's okay. It's, it's perfectly okay. Some people struggle with alcohol, cigarettes, gambling, sex, shopping, uh, but if you're struggling with obesity and being overweight, uh, realize that it's okay. Number two is ask for help and, and truly understand that uh, there are people out there that have been in your situation that love to help and that are there for you. Uh, I'm definitely one of them the best that I can. I just know that the more I focus on number three, meditation and going inwards, that I handle all my other BC, that the void that I'm trying to fill, fill with food I will never really be satiated. It's an internal void, it's deep within. And through my meditation, I can find number four and that's inner peace because when you find that inner peace, you won't have to overeat. When you find that inner peace, you'll be fuller much faster. When you find that inner peace, you're gonna sit down and just drink a glass of water before you order your food or you're gonna prep more food at home. And then number five is just, Lastly, make as much home cooked food as you can and, and realize that the more times you go to the grocery store, the more successful you're gonna be. That that's where it really starts. It starts, your success begins by preparing yourself. And even if that's a meal prep and if you have the budget and you have the money for meal prep, then that's perfectly fine. So just realize that those are your five strategies. Uh, I'm already starting to juice because I want to end the year really strong. Uh, about a month ago, I was about nearly 200 pounds on the scale and I just wasn't happy. Today I'm 186.3. I've been juicing for two days, haven't been eating much, been eating very little. My portions have come down. One thing I've been doing, a little bonus for you guys, is that if I'm with a friend or a family member, we'll split the salad. Uh, we'll split the, the sorbet yogurt, but we'll split a, a large a vegan smoothie or something. And I order large and split it versus, uh, you know, smaller portions, it's just, I find it much easier. And then lots of fruit, because I exercise a lot, I, I do a lot of fruit. So those are some tips for you with battling obesity, especially during the holidays. And be careful with the food you eat. Start the year, finish the year strong. Forget about January. Finish the year strong and use that to carry you on to next year. I'm gonna lose signal, send some love to Ventura and friends and family all over that just need it. They're not in a great place during the holiday season. So appreciate all the support. One love, hit like, subscribe, and share on YouTube. Namaste.